Yo guys, this week I'm excited to bring you the start of something fun. How do you feel about an AI game show? Where some of your favorite guests face off against an LSTM AI bot in a very Turing test fashion. Well, I'm proud to announce this new series where we'll be doing just that. Okay, let's go over how the software works real quick. Using Unity 3D, I wrote a fairly simple multiple choice game in which our guests will play to a designated amount of points. And first one to game point wins. Three out of four of the options are AI generated, and only one out of four are actually correct. If the guest can figure out which of the one out of four is correct, then they get a point. Else, the LSTM AI gets a point. The LSTM neural network is computed using Python and TensorFlow, which is then loaded into Unity 3D, in which we can then do whatever we want with it. But I have a plan to make a proper devlog for this project, so let's save the details and open source code for later. But now that you know what you're about to watch, feel free to place your bets. Our first guest for this series is going to be my good friend Diana from the Physics Girl channel. How do you think Diana's going to do? Do you think she's going to get destroyed? Or do you think that the AI is no match for her own titling wit? Well, without further delay, let's finally find out. Oh. And by the way, I had to talk moving my lips like the plebs do for this game show. I'm very sorry in advance if I let you down. And roll game show. Diana? Yes. Welcome to my channel. Thank you. I'm absolutely completely unorganized as always. <laughs> but I want to thank you for joining us. So while this is generating, what do you expect? That's well, I saw the Turing test on there somewhere, so I think you're gonna test if I'm a sentient machine. Okay, that's a good good guess. I'll yeah. let you in on, on what's going on here. So, a game show. You're on my AI game show. You're my guinea pig for my AI game show. Okay. Once this finishes loading, mm -hmm. you are gonna play against the AI that's gonna try and fool you by generating physics girl titles. Oh! So, three of the titles will be AI generated. Okay. And then one will be correct. And okay. so you're gonna have to choose which one you think you actually edit for a video. But that, I feel like, okay, I feel like I'm gonna win this though. Like, yeah. I am too familiar with my own titles. Okay, but, all right. But we'll see. I, I'm just gonna that. give you a warning that it learns from your patterns and it's gonna do almost anything to fool you, so. Oh. Okay, and you wrote this. Yes. You're yeah. such a bad, but how kid friendly is your channel? <laughs> oh, I should read the rules. So the rules are: if you get one wrong, mm -hmm. you have the opportunity to challenge. Okay. The database is actually already inside the game. Okay. So you just tell me you want to challenge. We'll pull it up and then it'll reference the, what you got wrong to the actual mm -hmm. title. Okay. It's not like I get to go change the title on my video. Yeah, you can't. You can't do that. That's <laughs> cheating. And let's do this. Yeah. What title is yours? Oh. Only one out of the four is your actual title. Oh, three, this three is Three of them are generated. So, what stretching actually do? Is this look white to you? <laughs> <laughs> Mind-boggling hiker riddle featuring Ann Wojcicki or five weird ways to put on, put out, ball, a can. And get it in. Five weird ways to put out, ball, a can. No, that's not my answer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pick um, green. Job. Yeah. Great job. Yeah. These are so funny. Swole riddle, wool vortex. <laughs> <laughs> QA with vortex rings, standing <laughs> waves on channeling plates. Cladney plates. Cladney. Cladney plates. Let me get that right. Interview with MIT Rick Business Girl trailer. <laughs> <laughs> the physics of witnesses flight featuring Emily. Yeah. These are too easy. <laughs> Why would I do a Q&A with the vortex rings? <laughs> physics girl does Q&A with, with giant physics demo. I'm gonna go with this one. Alright, alright. Too, Too easy. These are so funny though. Okay. Funniest college lecture skyscraper. <laughs> Why is the universe flat? Mm -hmm. Woman in Science News of 2011 Patch Wienerschmidt. <laughs> 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 Five Science News of 2011 with physics girl degree. Where's a part two? <laughs> this game is so hard. <laughs> I feel like this is like especially funny to me because I know all my videos and I know all my titles. Like this wouldn't be as funny to anyone unless I'm like a super fan of Physics Girl. <laughs> I don't think any of those exist. <laughs> Except for me. Wow, good job, good job. You're doing great. You're thank doing you, great. thank you. Alright, Physics Girl trailer. Okay. My path into 2011 <laughs> part two. My how path to, into 2011. <laughs> how to make clad me plates. Should you replace your eye with a camera? 
Actually, the last one could be legit. Should you replace your eye with a mm -hmm. camera? Yeah. Um, no, it's uh, not legit, but <laughs> but it's funny. Oh wow! Yeah. Good job, good job. Thank you. Are you shocked I'm getting my own I'm title? I'm completely right? shocked. <laughs> I'm mind boggled. So, how does laser cooling work? Yeah. How do mirrors flip horizontally but not vertically? Ooh. How to not vertically? Five awesome science news of 2011 with Fizz's Girl Trip. <laughs> uh oh. Uh, I don't know whether uh -oh. it's the first or second one. Uh -oh. How, does uh -oh. How do mirrors flip? I'm gonna go with this one. Oh, because wow. I think it was why do mirrors flip horizontally but not vertically? Wow. Yeah. Good job. Okay. So. That one was actually kind of hard. <laughs> no. The physics. Beer rail test. Ooh, I've never heard the beer rail test. We neither. <laughs> <laughs> Can you push a spacecraft with light? Uh -huh. Why do mirrorees the universe? What can you do with a physics riddle <laughs> featuring small <laughs> mirror? I should make some of these videos. <laughs> what is the usefulness of a physics riddle featuring Simone? <laughs> this one. Using science featuring FIFT. Mm. Yes. yes! Nice. This top one's good. Only some humans can solve these physics riddles. Mm. I should make that. Can you solve these physics riddles featuring Simone Yetch? Part 2 out of 3. Huh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. The bot's oh, on you. Oh, it's so nerve <laughs> it could be It could be green or blue. Oh. <laughs> I don't think I put Simone in the second title. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Amazing Pharaoh Fluid Fell featuring the Ponser. I don't think I wrote Amazing in that. The Boat Rock Brain Teaser featuring Simone Nerch. Part 2 out of 3. Woman in Hawaii, uh -uh. and Cuba, uh -uh. and Nigeria, and Indonesia, and Peru, and Sam. <laughs> well, so making liquid? I built an acoustic levitator making liquid. <laughs> I have to go with the first one. Oh! <laughs> no, that's not, that's not. That's not what? That's not a, the Boat Rock Brain Teaser? Oh, you want to challenge it? Yeah. Okay. I didn't do that with Simone. Okay. The Boat Rock, oh wait. Uh, let's do Boom. Did I? God, I did too many riddles with her. We're going to look at your database right now. The Boat Rock Brain Teaser featuring Simone. Yep, part two out of three. What? That's a title? So the amazing one is amazing fair fluid plus glow stick. Yeah, I knew there wasn't amazing in that one, but mm -hmm. I but the the boat rock brain teaser. What was check, that it, one? check it, check it, check it, oh check, check it, check it, check it, check it, check it. That is not fair. Check it. No gotcha. way. It I titled that. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, you Okay, special rounds of innocent paradox. Yes, that's the one. Calculating pi with Diana <laughs> on physics. <laughs> Alright, last point, last point, last point, last point. Very nice. Whew, Very 21 nice. to 1. Sweet. But it got a point. It got a point. Congrats. I it. That was super awesome. I, I won the turning desk. Didn't expect game. you to win so bad as you did. <laughs> yeah, but you I, have to do it. You gotta do it timed. Okay, yeah. I'm at a timer for sure. Yeah. I'm also gonna improve my, my bot. Yeah, improve that bot to only use English words. <laughs> All right, guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, we had lovely Diana here play against our bot. Obviously, our bot needs to do a lot more. <laughs> yeah, a lot more work. You got to work on bot. the intelligence of that artificial intelligence. Not, they work on the eye of the AI. <laughs> definitely not good enough to fool Diana with Turing test yet. But we will work on that. We will be back for part two. Yeah, I'm here. I'll be here to challenge when that happens. <laughs> but other than that, I want to throw to Diana's channel because we did a really fun video over her channel where we talked about quantum machine learning. Yeah, machine learning applied to quantum physics. That's the future. So if you want to check out, you know, where machine learning is going and different ways of solving problems with machine learning, please go check out Diana's channel. It's a lot of fun. You'll see us. It's also edited fully by Jabril. <laughs> I might have added an Easter egg in there somewhere. He is my. I, you didn't hear anything. What? <laughs> what? He is my team. So. <laughs> yeah, go check out Dana's channel. It's uh, the end card at the end of the screen, and um, I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Peace.